Now this seems a little different than our usual Dimash. This dropped at 4.30 a.m. Monday morning, if I remember correctly. But I didn't want to wait any longer, so this is the, this is the best I could do. I hope you don't mind. I'm very excited about this. Okay. Okay, sipping my energy drink. Let's see what our boy Dimash is up to. like a movie. did not see this coming. Oh my God. When he first, I'm, you know what? I'm going right back. I want to hear the beginning again. Oh, the voice. I was not expecting that. Making my way to the river. lost for this. Cause I'm looking for freedom. There's nothing but chance around me, but I won't be broken. Cause I'm gonna fight this time, fight every moment. Not gonna lie, it hurts this time.
Is it over? Ooh. Anybody else get a little flutter in there? Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I kind of want to watch it again. I know that's probably rude, but yeah, we're gonna watch it again. But let me just say a couple things first. I, who I was not expecting any of that. I knew the vampire theme was part of it. Okay. I knew that. And I will admit to you, I was a touch nervous. I was a touch nervous because there's a lot of hype around this video and I am generally not a vampire fan. Zombies. Hmm. Vampires. Meh. Not really my thing because I watched Interview with a Vampire. Didn't care for it, not really my thing. So I was a little nervous going into this. But let me tell you something. Someone like me, that's, can be a little critical as a director. You know what I'm talking about. You've heard me comment on things and like, bro, are you serious? That's what you picked out? Yes, that's what I picked out. I'm a director. I'm a little critical sometimes, and I'm not really a vampire fan. So to make me wanna watch this again for the sake of enjoyment, that's pretty impressive. Now I will warn you, I had to stop myself from pausing a whole bunch of times 
Now, I failed miserably that one time when I wanted to see that beginning again. You're just going to have to deal with that. I'm going to be stopping a few things here. Oh, man. so much good stuff in this like the story is very simple but it's very well executed the music sets the tone and even the car the car is classy the house is it's a little gaudy but it's classy this is, this is all setting the stage for the character that is Dimash. And you think her red umbrella was a coincidence? No. Now, this guy's look, also very well done. He has, the way they did him up, It gives us a little bit of uneasiness, right? It's a little uneasy. Yeah, very foreboding, that's right. And I love how the red and her umbrella is essentially, it's kind this red is kind of the only color that we're really seeing, if I think about it. Forget the texts, okay? So we've got small, we've got this part of the building here, we've got some shades of what looks like maroon back here, and her umbrella, that's it. The rest is very monochrome. Yeah, good transition. You see how she responded to the beat. That's brilliant. That's brilliant. Because as listeners, we hear the song and we think it's, okay, well, that's for us, but we're watching. We're disconnected. When she responds to what we just heard, there's a little bit of a, a meshing that's happened. Oh, yeah, this is really clever. Oh, yeah. Making my way, way down south to the river. Ran lost for the. That note ruins me. I peed a little on that one. Cause I'm looking for freedom. Mm. There's nothing but chance. Me, but Ooh. I won't be broken Cause I'm gonna fight this time Fight every moment no. She is good. She is very, very good. And whoever the director was, I saw the name and I didn't, I didn't think to repeat it. She starts reacting to his behavior. Very tense. Very nervous. Oh, she's really good. She's she's subtle, but she's really good. There's nothing but chance around me, but I won't be broken. Mm. Cause I'm gonna fight this time. Fight every moment. Oof. Not gonna lie, it hurts this time.
little run right there was so good. Now this shift that he does, this was almost like a second character, like the next level of power that he has when he brings this low voice. Oh. Oh. I name my place just a man in a man's world, making a name. Oh. It's easy these days, but when I come home to your sweet love, you're my size of heaven. have guessed of this guitar solo. It's so perfect. See how the roles have turned? Or have they? back to where it started. Uncover the mystery behind the curtain in DQ's exclusive first ever interview with an unknown journalist. Oh, Dimash, DQ, I was thinking Dairy Queen, no. Mystery behind the curtain in Dimash exclusive first ever interview with an unknown journalist. A daily beat. Wow. My man keeps it fresh, doesn't he? Does anybody else think that he should be, uh, he should be keeping this hair? Or is that just me? I think that this should be like the thing. 
I don't know how to explain it, but there's like several notes in the song where either I thought he was going to go a different direction, but he went not only another direction. How do I explain this? Some of you that are singers or musicians, a chord is made up of multiple notes. Okay. So like G is, you know, G and D and, uh, F, right? That makes up G, okay, as a chord. If if on a scale you have these ways that you can go to stay within the key, there's like three or four times where Dimash went somewhere else that I was totally not expecting. And not only did it sound good, it sounded great and it went with the vibe of the video. It wasn't really dissonance, but it just kind of went somewhere else. Like this first piece. That little rise, that little vocal rise. Yeah. Wait for it. Been lost for the There's nothing but chance around me, but I oh, bro. I loved this. I loved this. I was a little worried, but I loved this. Man. Man, he crushed it. This is gonna sound dumb, but I'm gonna say it anyway, because I feel like it's kind of a given. Dimash's voice is like its own character. In this video, we have him, we have her, we have the butler, we've got, you know, the, the vampire girls that are on the table. Um, we've got all these little different characters, some major, some minor, but yet on top of that, Dimash's voice is like another character, which is, is pretty badass. The other day I told you the one movie that I, not the one, the first movie I tell people about when I say, hey, you wanna watch a good movie? Go watch this movie. It's the movie, A Quiet Place. John Krasinski, Emily Blunt, A Quiet Place. That's one of the first movies that I have seen where sound and or silence plays a main character in a very unique way. We've seen a ton of Dimash videos. His voice is incredible. It just kind of comes with the territory. But the way that he used it in this, it felt like a different character. I don't know if that's what they were intending, but not only that, there's almost two levels of it. There's this voice. It's like this soft introduction. He's slowly bringing her in. Okay, just come on in, it's fine. It's easy, gently. This is the voice that he uses to seduce us with. And then when he finally puts her in the spot of the interview and he allows himself to come out, it changes. My arms on when I come. Right here. Finding my place, just a man in a man's world. That's crazy. You see what I mean? That's brilliant. She was so good. 
Yeah, the, the use of the color, the lighting, the darkness, the voices. Even, even here, these minor characters of the girls with the teeth, the vampires at the table. But when I come home. Used them perfectly. There's two bits of uneasy, two bits of like uh, physical dissonance we get. Watch. Okay, so they kind of come in. The first shot we see outside of the, the seductive aspect is that little face from her to show that they're not to be toyed with. Okay, they, they mean business. But when I come home to your sweet love, you're my size yeah. of heaven. Now the dissonance is coming up. Right there, and then this one. It's just weird enough to that you kind of go like, what am I, what am I supposed to be seeing? And it just kind of throws you off pace wise. You damn well better stop that music for that note. And then all this gateway to heaven, when we get back to this last scene here and we see this little portal that we've got, the gateway to heaven. What a burst. Damn, I loved that. Whew, I am glad I loved that. That would have been awkward. Wow. All right, so for those of you that was your first time, I hope you enjoyed it. Hell, a quarter of as much as I did. I tore that thing up. Man, that was awesome.